Hello guys, this is Gina Michelle at You Can't Be Crafting and I'm so so excited for this sneak peek. I love this artwork. I love this whole kit and I cannot wait to open it for you guys. And no, it's not a picture of J-Hope of course. This is Misunderstood. The artist is Anna Morte. I hope I'm saying that correctly. At first glance, it reminded me of Helena Bonham Carter from Fight Club. If any of you guys have seen that movie, hopefully you kind of see that reference. But you know, I love kind of darker paintings a lot of the time. I love lighter ones too, but this one, I knew I had to show it to you guys and I cannot wait to look at the canvas and the colors and everything. As you can see, of course, like I said, it's square, 56 by 71. I already took the plastic off, but I haven't done anything, so I'm so excited to open up this box. Let's go. So as always, there are diamond painting instructions on the back of the box, but there are much better ones inside and online, so... They're just extra kind for adding them on the back. Diamond Art Club always goes the extra step. We know this. Let's pull this canvas out. I'm so excited. Here she is. The <laughs> sticker and my toolkit are stuck. I had to open up the other side of the box but first there is a little sticker and this is the one that I would suggest you put if you like to kit up. I would put it on the box just for example. This is a scent but you know if you have a box and you've kitted up you could put this sticker right there so if you paint multiple paintings at a time like I do or if you just like to be organized you can put it right here or you can put it on your kits if you like to put them away say you want this painting but you don't want to paint it right away maybe save it for Halloween you can always put it at the end of the box that way when you're looking at all of your Diamond Art Club boxes if you're like me you have many and you can just say oh there she is right there. That way you don't have to open up every kit or pull every box out to look at the picture on the front. Let's open up this tool kit and bye J-Hope. Now this is a square so we will get the tweezers but if you do get a diamond art club painting and it's round you will get this exact same tool kit just minus the tweezers. First, ooh, <laughs> I dropped two things. Where is it? Our green squishy, which will go on our green diamond painting pen. Hmm. Two multi-placers. They are a four and a seven. We have our new beautiful glittery trace with a plug, which is amazing. I love the Diamond Art Club out of these so so much and I also got a new I've never had this type of cup reminder which just reminds me of an AB diamond just like my other one I got this one and another kit don't these look like AB Aurora Borealis diamonds to you if they came in hearts well oh sorry <laughs> I stick it to the metal on my desk it gave me washi tape which just has a beautiful design. It almost looks like butterflies. I just love the new edition because you never know what you're going to get. It's so much fun. Then we have a great amount of baggies. Then a cute little heart tray with two, always two, heart waxes. And it's the dark red, which is widely considered the better red wax. If you like the light pink, of course I'm not saying that yours isn't good. That's just what I've always seen and heard. And I love the little heart containers. Oh, we also get, and if you are new to diamond painting, well, 
you're very brave because you started it out with a square. Well, if you do have these tweezers, please. They are so sharp. They're beautiful, but so, so sharp. So always keep this on. And if you have pets who could step on them or little kids, I would just honestly keep them put away. That's what I do. So that's what comes in our toolkit. And I'll go ahead and put everything away and take the plastic off of our canvas. And then we will look at our diamonds and do everything we always usually do. I am so, so, so excited to see Misunderstood by Anna Morte. Let's clean this up. Voila. So, so let's see. Here is the top. Ooh. First here are our diamonds misunderstood with A B. And look at these colors, guys. I cannot wait to go through these. You'll get an every kit. Just thank you. What's included? Little tips and tricks and here. Your next purchase thank you 10 and if you want to use my code if you're a first-time buyer you can use right here you caught me crafting I'll do sparkles you caught me crafting <laughs> for $10 off your first order and then when you receive this you'll get 10% off your next purchase and here's another little tip sorry I was holding it where my dress was showing First, you have thank you 10. Well, first you can use my code for $10 off. If you want, please, no pressure at all. Then you can use thank you 10. Then you can use slip 15. There are always just little codes and coupons that Diamond Art Club is giving us. They're just so wonderful like that. If you use the QR code right here, you can do a step-by-step -step video instructions, or you can just go on YouTube and look at your favorite YouTubers' instructions. I haven't made a video like that, but maybe I should just kind of a how-to blank diamond paint, you know? But I haven't yet, so... <laughs> but there's so many amazing creators out there. Then here also is the VIP Facebook group and I will link the normal Facebook group, the VIP Facebook group, um, Diamond Art Club's Instagram. I will link everything down below. I will link Anna Morte's social media, their website, everything that I can find. So don't fret if you don't know how to scan QR codes or anything like that. I will link everything step-by-step -step instructions, very clear cut, and in multiple languages, we appreciate that. Back. If you download the app, you get 20%, see it's going 10, 15, 20, 20% 20 off your first purchase. And Diamond Art Club does have their point system, so with every purchase you're earning points, which helps you get money off, but just, it all helps you. Here's how we do it around here. I'm going to show you the picture and all of this, but then we'll look at the canvas and we'll ooh and ah at how gorgeous it is. Then we'll go through the drills. We'll look at all of the colors and then I will cut out the ABs and I will show you everywhere the ABs are going to go. Then I'll show you a close up of the entire drill field. That's how all of my sneak peek videos go. And Sorry, I've been adding stickers slowly to my drafting table because they just make me happy. <laughs> Look at this artwork, you guys. Misunderstood. And now she also reminds me of Winona Ryder in Edward Scissorhands, kind of. Basically, any pale, dark-haired <laughs> character, kind of corpse bride also. And Amorte, please, I am so sorry if I'm pronouncing that wrong, but... I just adore their work. I bought so many of their paintings and I was so, so honored. I was like, please, please let me show this one. Again, you see it's square 56 by 71. And this is the picture that I put in my logbook. 
start date, end date, and she kind of looks like a doll. You see, she's cracked right there. She's like a porcelain doll. There are so many details. She's got a violin behind her. Looks like, um, what's it called? So not lyrics, but music. There's a statue. It looks like a baby covering its face, sad behind her, and she looks like she's sitting in a a very beautiful chair. Looks like one of her eyes is gone. This is just gorgeous. And you can see the like roses. There's a rose here. And we'll see everything on the drill field. But look at this artwork you guys. And you would think maybe. Not too many colors. But 49 colors. And 5 ABs. I'm so excited to see where those are going to go. And here, let's take a look at the symbols. I don't see anything that could be confusing. But again, when we look at the drill field, we'll point out if there's anything. But to me, everything looks great. Let's go ahead and look at this gorgeous canvas. And I didn't know that she was going to match my fingers, kind of. Ready? Let's see if this is the top. It is. Because it says, do what makes you sparkle. Look, we can see her bow. And we can see that we have the symbol chart up here. Oh my goodness, look at the clarity. This is gorgeous. You can see her violin, the chair, the candelabra that's in front of the statue. Look at the skies. And down here, you can see right here, Diamond Art Club social media. And then right here, again, take 10 for 10% off your next order. They just have coupon codes everywhere. And here is your lifetime warranty. Basically, if you have missing diamonds, they would get them to you ASAP. And if there's anything wrong with your canvas that can't be fixed, which 99.9% .9 of the time there's an easy fix, but if they can't fix it, of course they would help you out and send you another one. Diamond Art Club's customer service is incredible. Here we have a little picture. And we have again, misunderstood, 56 by 71. And more to hit, so important to buy licensed work, guys. Diamond Art Club. Look at this guy. Look at her. Tim Burton vibes, right? So many different types of influences. And the colors. Yeah, I can't even tell. She almost looks like a porcelain doll, right? And here you can much more clearly see the crack. And I will message Anna Morte if I can get her message on time. I will include it in the video. But if not, when they get back to me, I will put it in a pinned comment below. I always try to reach out to the artists and just ask what inspired them or what inspires them to make art in general, what inspires them as a person. So if you don't see it in the video, it will be in a pinned comment. And if they don't get back to me, it's because they're busy. You know, artists are busy and I'm sure that so they get so many messages that you know, mine's not going to stick out or anything, so <laughs> if I can't get that information, I always love knowing that, but I will link all of their social media and their website, so it's definitely going to be worth taking a look at all of their gorgeous artwork, and I'm sure there'll be something about them on the website about why they started creating art or anything like that. I can't quit staring. This is gorgeous, and the colors, ugh. This is definitely one, and I have so many whips, you guys, but 
she's so pretty. I might just have to force myself to save her for October. The colors and everything and just everything about this screen. Start me right now. <laughs> okay, so we have all of our beautiful colors laid out and I will go through them. Maybe I can try to find some spooky music to put behind these. <laughs> So ready, we have 3837-744-413. And look at the clarity. Diamond Art Club manufactures their own diamonds, so they're great. Oh, look at this little guy. 211. Look at just great quality. 208. 742. And 130, our first AB. And for those who don't know, AB is Aurora Borealis. It just has an extra coating of shine, and you'll see why when I talk about those. It's kind of like my nails. <laughs> a couple of them have extra shine, so it makes them stand out a little bit. We have 209, 126. Beautiful kind of ballerina pink AB. 210, 3727, 839, and 317. Here we have another AB. Another beautiful pink 128. Gorgeous. I love this color, 915. This is one of my favorite colors, I think. It's just so rich and pretty. 3033, 838, 3836. This one's very pretty also. 779, and 340. Wow, all of these purples and purple blues are so gorgeous to me. If you love this color palette, I cannot stress how gorgeous these diamonds are. 3807, 3609, 718, you can see no static, 3608, so pretty. 3860 and 3607. And I'll turn it around just so you can see the backs. Beautiful. 155. Another gorgeous purple blue. 3756. 327. Kind of a Deep wine purple. 117. Another AB. Remember, five ABs here, guys. This will be fun. 333 and 3746. Here, 948. 141. Another AB. This is going to be a Gorgeous diamond painting. I can already tell. Man, I want to start. I want to start it right now. I'm so excited. Three eight three four. Oh, two bags of three eight three four. And one fifty eight seven ninety two. Four fifty two. Three eight. Three five, another beautiful purple, and four fourteen. That deep gray. I mean, look at this quality. Here we have three eighteen. We have two bags of five fifty. Beautiful purple. One fifty four. Oh. Two bags of 154. You can really see in darker colors. 
if there's bad quality, that's where you'll be able to see it. And three tens or darker colors, and these are just perfection. And here's 415. A lighter color, but still, as you can see when I move them around, just straight edges everywhere. Here we have 3861. 762 and two bags of 336. A dark, dark blue. Beautiful. We have two colors that have four bags, and one is 823. course with this painting you knew that there would be <laughs> I'm sorry of course with this painting you knew that there would be a couple of darker colors with more bags so here's 823 and then of course four bags of 310 black 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 okay, hopefully my camera can pick up the quality with Diamond Art Club, what I was saying is 310 is often used to sharpen things, to make things stand out, to outline things. So we'll look at this painting and see on the drill field. But, and I'll take a close up look really quick. These are amazing guys, and I hope you trust me by now. A bunch of you have ordered paintings that I have shown you, and you've said you love them, and you've been working on them, and now you're buying your second order, and I am so, so happy that you found something that calms you and that you love, and you know I never lie to you about the quality. We've looked at all the beautiful colors, and... Here are our ABs, and I'm so excited to see where they go. This is one that I cannot wait to do. But she just, something about her and the colors. So let's go ahead and start with her first AB. Let's start with 117. Number one, this beautiful AB. And I'll do what I always do. Let's start from the bottom, guys. And... I am going to mess with the canvas as I go, just because I always do. <laughs> for number one, we'll start at the bottom and work our way up. And for two, work our way down from the top and back and forth for all five. Okay, and just follow my finger. I know that you can't see the symbols. Mainly just trust my finger and then when you get a close-up of the drill field, just remember that all of the AB symbols are numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. So anytime you see 1 through 5, there's an AB there. And I'll point them out a little bit as we go. For number 1, I'll leave the AB so you can see. Let's see here. Okay, you can see right here the lighter parts are ABs right here. They go down there. There's some right here. And many more right here. That little lighter section under these three tens, those are ABs. And yes, I will whisper to myself because it helps me find them. Once, ooh, I'm not gonna get ahead of myself. Okay, can you see here? See this little light area right there? That's AB's ones right here where my thumb is. Those are some ones. And then there are ones right here, that light area. Those are ones. And then there are ones right here. 
and right here. There are a ton of ones in this baby statue right here. So, they're here, 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 and then as we move up, there are two ones right there. Ones here, they're just ones. Here's a group of ones. 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 Where are my fingers going? There are ones. 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 More ones everywhere my fingers going, remember. Way up here. Ones, 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 ones. Ones. So it's kind of like outlined in ones, which makes sense with this being the AB color. It's going to make this statue in the back kind of pop and be beautiful. So we have one and the music. And we have one in the statue. Now we'll go from the top to the bottom. Number two. Poquito. This beautiful purplish pink. 126 look. I'm going to look for twos. And I'm sure they'll be in just one area. <laughs> The bottom of her corset or baby doll looks kind of like a baby doll corset sort of you know there we go there are twos right here kind of just a little bit and twos right here so we just have them at the bottom of her We'll call it a nighty at the bottom of her nighty. Right there, going up to here. And then two is going from here down to here. And they're the lighter ones. I know you can't see the two, but you can see the lighter area. Those are the twos. Let me spend just a second. There are twos anywhere else. That'll be so pretty. Just kind of emphasizing her little nighty. I don't see any, but if I do spot some as we go through and look for other ADs, of course I'll point them out. So now, these canvases are just so much fun to like smooth out and touch, I don't know. Number three is 128. Pretty pink. So number three. There are threes right here. This you can see it's a little bit darker than it gets lighter. These are the threes where it's lighter. And then in the roses, there are always threes, I noticed. They're here, down here. There's some up here. These roses, there aren't any on this tiny one, but on this rose we have threes. And as we move up, right here, on her bow, we have threes. This lighter part right here, right here, and right there, we have threes. Threes, 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 threes. everywhere my fingers touching, remember guys. 
crease and then three on the little thing connecting her little nighty. We have threes on her pretty lips. She has such pink lips, such expressive eyes. And then on this candle, we have threes here. Threes here. And threes here, so threes on the candles too. So in all the roses, except for I think two, this rose I mean has threes. So all the roses except for the two small, small, small ones have threes. But we do have threes in her bow. Threes, threes, threes trees. So this is going to be bright pink and a sea of three tens. So these are all going to be black and then darker colors. Then we'll have a bright pop of pink and then an even brighter pop out of the bow with those ABs. What a great choice to put that pink in the middle of a little darker part of the canvas. And if you've seen, even with the four bags of two colors, there's no big color blocking areas, you know? I honestly don't see a single huge area of color blocking. I love that. The black is really going to be used to emphasize things and you can see like the cracks on the walls will be three tens. So that's just great. Oh my goodness, this is making me want to work on this more and more. So four is 130. Yellow. I think I can be safe and just going right here to the candle. And I did look just in case, but the fours are going to be, there are four fours right here. And then in the flames, there are fours. Those bright yellows, those are all ABs. So the flames are going to really stand out and pop with this yellow. I love. Then five, we have the beautiful lighter AB 141. So let's see where five is. None at the top. There's some right here. So remember we had a bunch of ones in the statue. There are also fives. Can you see that really light part? Yeah, if I look through my camera, I can see. Fives, follow my finger. Fives in the candle, kind of. Yeah, in the candle flame, actually. Fives. And fives. Fives in the flame again. Fives around the candle. Fives. Fives in this flame, too. And then also in the statue, fives. So on the statue and the candle, we have some ABs, some of those bright white ABs. Let's look on the left side. Ooh, cool. Since she, I honestly think porcelain, so this would make sense. There, right here, see this different shading in her skin 
which number one don't be worried she's a doll i think a live doll but <laughs> or something she's misunderstood <laughs> but all of this darker area right here these are all fives and this long line also fives There are two fives in this eye, and then in this one, because it's kind of like a, not a dead eye, what is it, a cloudy eye? Where it got, I don't want to say knocked out, I'm not sure, it just kind of has aged something. Even though she's a doll, but obviously it looks like she's been left somewhere. Mm -hmm. Nobody visits, so if, you know, you might agree with me that she seems like a porcelain doll, you know, this makes perfect sense for her to be sparkling and shiny. And this right here, these are ABs, this big patch of fives. Gorgeous and and long her arm right here. Those are fives. So remember all of the darker parts on her chest. That's where a ton of fives go. Then along her arm and the candles. And I don't see any at the bottom. So I think they are just really trying to emphasize the fives on her to make her skin beautiful. Well, not I don't know if it's skin. You know what I mean, though. To make her beautiful and shiny. But look at this artwork. Thank you so much, Anamorte. Look at this drill field. Look how clear it is. See how those three tens aren't really grouped? They're like, it's kind of like there's a cracked wall behind her. But look at the clarity. See? Remember, this is square. Forty nine colors. There's her bow, the threes. So cute. And her hair. and personal look at the clarity and the symbols see the two fives in that eye right there her right our left <laughs> then her lips with the three just those pinks you can see the shading on her chin Gorgeous. Look right there, perfect. So many different symbols, colors, but it's so, so clear. Here's her chest. You can see those fives. So many fives. And more fives right here. Going down into her nighty. See those fives top left? Her nighty has threes. It's going to be so cute. 
And as we move down, you can see all these different colors. This one I feel like for a square. There's no huge multi-placing. And the black is more of an outline. I feel like this would be a great square to start off if you're a little bit timid about squares. I understand. I work on the squares and I'm still like, man, this takes me so much longer than rounds. But they're so gorgeous. I'm not a round or square gal. I love both. As long as the quality of the canvas, there's some threes seeing the flowers. Let's see, just not in that tiny one, anything bigger. I'm like, that has threes here. This one has threes. And then we get to the bottom corner and see that's where. And a little bit more multi placing, but I mean, there's so many breaks in that and color changes. I think it's music. Since she's holding a violin, or there's a violin next to her. I don't see music symbols clearly. But I can take a look at the art. And here are two more flowers. The right one has some ABs. And here is her violin. Sorry, there we go. I'm just gonna slowly move up. Violin, see those bees? And sevens. Here's the violin, the top of it. You can see it looks like one of the strings broke. <laughs> Back to her bow and her beautiful 310 hair. Just quick rundown. Square. Artist and Amorte. Devon Art Club. 56 by 71. 49 colors. 5 ABs. Gorgeous. And let me quickly measure. 56 by 71. Do, 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 do. Fifty. Fifty-six, you can see. Oh, okay, so right here is the zero. And then I have to scoot it over. You can see there's the six. So 56 is perfect. Let's see the height. Shorty, short people problems always. Okay, so there's another one. There's 71 right there, because there's 70, so 71, 56 by 71. This measures perfectly. Again, everything will be linked down low. 
please comment, tell me what you think about this, who she reminds you of, everything like that. I'd love to know. I didn't even think to say it, but it's not April Fool's now, but happy April Fool's Day. This is not a joke. This painting will be going on sale tomorrow, April 2nd, Saturday. General release is at 9.30 a.m. Pacific Standard Time, 12.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, and Diamond and Ruby Tears release at 9 a.m. Pacific Standard Time and 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. But they always leave kits for general release, so don't worry if you're not in the Ruby and Diamond tier. Hopefully you guys will pick her up and you'll show me in your Instagram feeds. Look at her. I'm obsessed. And I'd love for you to comment below what she reminds you of or who, like, I've mentioned, you know, Winona Ryder and Edward Scissorhands or Marla in Fight Club, Helena Bonham Carter, a porcelain doll, what you think she is or who she reminds you of, what actress, something like that, or just how you like this picture, anything like that. I would love to know. So I'm going to end it like I always do. Stay kind to yourself. Stay kind to others. They don't know what you're going through and you don't know what they're going through. Life is tough for everybody. We just have to make the best of it with what we've got. So if you think this picture would make you happy, it makes me so happy. Mark your calendar. Well, it'll be tomorrow, so get ready for tomorrow. She will be on sale at Diamond Art Club. Again, every, everything I will link down below. I won't mention it again because you guys know. I'm just so excited. I adore this artist. I adore this painting. I adore their other paintings. And I really hope you guys will love this artwork just as much as I do. Legally licensed, drill field is immaculate. You saw the colors and the quality of the drills, beautiful. Honestly, what's not to love, you know? I will see you guys so, so soon. And I can't wait till maybe October when I can work on her. Maybe I'll just do a spooky painting. Look at her. I can't stop myself. I can't wait to see her finished on your timeline, so I hope that you guys adore her. Thank you so much for watching this. Please subscribe, like this video, it just helps me out so much and it's so easy. Comment. You can comment about this picture, ask questions, video suggestions, anything like that. I'm always up to making videos to help you guys or answer questions, answer questions about this painting. I'm noticing it looks a lot more like music notes now from kind of farther away, you know? I just love everything about this kit. Thank you so, so, so much to Diamond Art Club for letting me be a small, small, tiny, minuscule part of your company just in letting me show these sneak peeks of art that I truly love. Thank you, thank you so much. And most of all, thank you to all of you watching. You're amazing. I'll see you guys so, so soon. You're so important to so many people, including me. Bye. Look at her. Gorgeous.